Randy Jean Cheek, and have I got a hysterical haul story for you, along with a haul. Last Friday, well, it was last night, but whenever I get this video up, it'll be, it would have been Friday. Um, JCPenney was having a spend $100, get $20 off. Probably one of the most stressful shopping experiences of my life, and let me tell you why. Um, Brett went with me, and I, I love to go shopping with Brett because it's fun, but he does not like to shop, so he complains. And I'm to the point now where I'm like, I don't even want to go shopping with me anymore. But, we get there, and, you know, Albuquerque's been in a drought, and Mexico's been in a drought, but we've been having our monsoon season, so we've been getting a little bit of rain. I'm like looking through the clearance racks at JCP and I'm from Michigan. I know what tornadoes are like and I would have swear we were having a tornado. Not even kidding. I'm like looking at the um like the dresses and stuff like that that are on clearance and I just hear this wind and I'm like, holy crap. So I have like a bunch of stuff in my hand to go try on. So I'm like, okay, I'm like, I'm gonna go try this stuff on. Now Brett's downstairs looking at boy clothes and stuff, and um I try everything on. I don't know, like, if I was, like, kind of stressed out about the storm, but, like, nothing fit right, and I was, like, eh. So I kept putting a lot of stuff back. So when I come out of the dressing room, I, like, look out the door, and it is raining and so windy that you can't even see out the door, and people are, like, gathered around the doors. So, like, my first thought is, hmm, this is a tornado people don't want to be staying in the door. Now, we rarely have tornadoes here in the southwest, like, never. Um, mainly it's, like, Texas on as tornadoes so I was like okay I doubt this is a tornado so I'm like should I call Brett or should I just like be adult about this and just continue shopping so I continue shopping I'm in the dressing room and I hear Brett come to the dressing room and he's like are you in here because he always knows the dressing rooms that I'm in and I'm like yeah he's like have you seen outside and I was like well kinda you know it's raining and windy um, there were trees down everywhere. The power flickered a little bit. So I tried on the clothes that I wanted to and basically we were went to get in line to leave. Um, anytime I go into JCP, they scan my phone for the coupon. I never print my coupons out, ever. So I'm standing in line. And it's, you know, it's a new girl. God bless her for being new. Not giving her a hard time at all. But, like, the girl who was supposed to be helping her was being so rude to her. And, like, she was trying to help her, but then she was trying to help the customers, too. So this girl, she basically was like, figure it out yourself. So she was trying to type in, like, this 20-digit long coupon code. And I'm like, you know what? For 20 bucks, I'm, I'm not going to leave without getting my 20 bucks off otherwise I just won't buy the clothes because I was not like attached to them so it takes her I'm not kidding you like 15 minutes I have to stand there and wait and wait and wait for her to try to figure this out which I'm not blaming her at all um I think my tone is just the fact that I feel like crap today so you know I'm sorry if this is like really blunt but like I so we waited like 15 minutes and I'm just seeing myself I'm like you know what and now it's like storming bad like super 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 bad so bad Brett left me to go get the FJ Cruiser because the trees were falling and I'm like you know what maybe I should just leave this stuff here maybe this is like God's way of saying Amanda you need to quit shopping so <laughs> I'll destroy the mall if I have to but I'm like so but I had already scanned my debit card I was like well I don't want to get charged for stuff if I don't get the stuff so, long story short, um, they finally figured it out after like 15-20 minutes. I get outside, it's pouring rain so bad, like you can't see. So we um, leave the mall to head back up to Rio Rancho, which is where we live, and it is like, the streets are flooded, there's trees down, which we don't have any trees anyway, so kind of upsetting, but... So bad flooding. Uh, I guess like I-25 was shut down. It was a bad storm. It was really bad. So I can honestly say like I was in the mall through and they think that it could have been a funnel cloud that hit um, the mall and then hit uh, like south just a little bit because it was like the wind speeds were that bad. They said they had winds over 90 miles an hour which I believe it because as I was standing there pay paying, the women's section uh, in the Cottonwood Mall is second story. So, like, the floor was doing this, and I'm like, holy moly. It was, it was really freaky, but got my stuff. 
So, and I got my, and it ended up, I just looked at my receipt, and she only gave me $10 off, not $20 off. So, I'm not going to argue about 10 bucks because at least I'm alive. You guys, what I bought at JCP, and then I also went to Walmart this afternoon looking for a new hair wand, and I didn't really find anything, so... I'm going to keep looking, but I want to do my JCP haul first because that is what has clothes, and I love clothes. I picked up three shirts and a pair of jeans. Um, my shirts were about $10 to $12 a piece, and my jeans, I'll wait until the end to tell you how much they were because they were, like, basically free. <laughs> now, um... The first shirt I bought is I never wear yellow. Uh, yellow hates me. But sometimes I can get away with neon yellow. And this is a neon yellow color that I can get away with. And it's just... Oh, I hate it when my camera does that. It's just this neon yellow shirt. It's high-low. Um, high, lower on the back, high on the front. And then it has a, a tie here at the front. It's made out of polyester. So it was originally... Originally $28 and I got it for $15, but then I had that coupon, so I got it for probably like $12. So I liked it. I um, I love the neon trends, so I actually bought this because I'm working on... Oh, my camera color. I'm blue. Wait for me to come back to non-alien. Okay. I actually bought this so I can um, start my fall wardrobe, my lookbook, because I'm putting together my outfits for fall and one of the fall trends that I'm like loving right now and I'm super excited to wear is um, neon and camel color because I love camel color but I also bought the same type of shirt in turquoise because I like how they fit too they felt flowy but they didn't feel like they were baggy so I, I really liked that so I bought it in turquoise too so I have it in yellow and turquoise because I'm not afraid of color. Um, this shirt I was not really in love with, but uh, I thought about it with um, my black leather skirt. So this was originally $24 and I picked it up for $13, which means I probably paid about $10. But it's just this blue and black shirt with some lace detail on the top. That's the lace. And then it's just blue and then it's black on the back. So, I thought it was cool. Um, it's, sh it's short sleeved. It, actually, no sleeves. Um, I didn't have like a huge, wonderful JCPenney shopping experience like I normally do. I just, I didn't, like I said, I don't know if I was stressed out about the storm or if I just was like starting to not feel well last night. So, for me to walk out of JCP with only four things and a hundred bucks to spend, and I only spent 40. No, I didn't even spend 40. I spent like 35. Um, pretty much this to you that I was feeling like crap. So, the next thing I bought is originally these jeans were $32, marked down to clearance to $20, and then reduced all the way down to $4.97. And with my $10 off coupon that I thought was $20, they ended up being like $3.50 or something. And it's these red jeans. Um, I do have to hem them on the bottom because they are too long. So, what I'm actually thinking about doing is, um, doing kind of a cool DIY fashion project that I'm going to keep to myself until I decide if I want to do it or not. <laughs> but there, that was my GCP haul. I, um, I just really wasn't going to shop, so. But what I bought at Walmart when I was walking through, because I'm looking for a new hair wand. Mine died, so I don't know if I want to shell out, um, the money for a new me, because I just, I don't know. So if you have, what, what type of, like, hair wand do you guys use? If you could let me know what you like or what ones you don't like, um, that would be so helpful to me. Because two of two Rimmel products. This one uh, I actually used in the car on the way home. Uh, it's the Stay Glossy 3D. It says up to the sixth shine in a 3D effect lip gloss. And this is in color lights camera action. But that's the. But that's the product. Um, it's basically like a clear lip gloss. I thought it was more orangey when I picked it up, but it has glitter, which gives it the, uh, the, th the 3D effect is glitter. So, but that's a swatch of it. It is kind of orangey, I guess, but on my lips it looked pretty clear, so. But yeah, 
the one thing I do like about this is I am so picky about the, the makeup products that I buy at Walmart because sometimes they're opened and that just, oh, that ticks me off. So I love it when you have the seals. That's so important to me. The next thing I bought is I've never tried a Rimmel eyeliner before and I heard the Scandalize is great. So I bought the Rimmel London Scandalize Waterproof Coal Eyeliner in uh, brown. I guess it's just the color. So that's it. Again, you know, I've never used a Rimmel eyeliner, so I thought that it would be cool to try because I love my Urban Decays. That's kind of my, my favorites. My Urban Decays and my MAC eyeliners. So this is the actual. I picked brown because I do need a new brown eyeliner. So if I like this, I'm, I'll probably go back and get black, but... Wow, it feels really smooth. That's a swatch. So this is kind of what I bought at JCP and at Walmart to yesterday and then into today. If you enjoyed this small JCP haul and my small Walmart haul, please give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!